Guys, we're all alone here in the jungle. I'm just kidding, there's loads of people. <laughs> Two bodies become one. <laughs> and the passion of the moment. Cause I'm your lady. <laughs> wow. And you are my man. So according to Google's five easy steps to climbing Teapot Mountain, step one, don't drink the entire night before. <laughs> We're behind the museum, right? The gold museum? Yeah. So we have to go behind the museum and then I'm sure it'll just become obvious That's at that it. point. Ooh, look at that. That little bit of sexiness. We're gonna climb it. Shit. I did a quick wardrobe change. As you can see, I figured jeans weren't the way to go for this kind of hike. And then that's the summit. Yes, yeah. It's a little bit uh, easy, bro. Yeah. It's a little bit anticlimactic. <laughs> Almost, yeah. <laughs> the view is stunning, though. <sighs> we just have one more set of stairs, I think, and we're there. The question is, how long do we wait for those people to either come down or more people to come up? <laughs> Try to find like a gap. <laughs> How did she get up without sweating? She looks beautiful. Makeup perfect. They, they don't sweat, I swear to God. Good luck, Damien. I don't get long legs like you do. Like, how many poles does that rope really have left in it? Yeah. <laughs> King Kong. <laughs> At this point, we felt like we were eating this mountain for breakfast, leaving Bear Grylls and Christopher Columbus and the like in awe of our immaculate achievement. Once inside the cave, there's two little holes you can choose to climb through. Damien and I, like good, obedient sheep, chose to go through the upper hole where everyone else seemed to be going, and Patty went to the right. Now what do you think? Think about what? Everything. Oh. Well, it's like. a nice view, but, you know, it's kind of, it's, a, it's beautiful, but still is a bit ruined by the amount of tourists that are up here. Yeah. Yeah. Just a little bit. Yeah. Everyone seemed to think that Damien understood Chinese. And because Damien didn't correct them, he got a full set of what we think were instructions on how to use the rope to traverse the rock. This is in the top. So this is going to the next mountain? That's... <laughs> that's where we're actually trying to go. Right there. That's Teapot Mountain. I have no idea. None of this shit looks like a teapot. Doesn't have, there's no tea plantations. There's no fucking tea anything. <laughs> Should be called Selfie Mountain. <laughs> Give us the official Yelp review of this mountain so far. Very dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> and overcrowded, yeah. but really good fun. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. How I mean, many look stars? At this. How many stars out of five? Four and a half. Look at this guy. <laughs> ah, that's our boy. Look at that. Woo! Oh. 
Yeah, there doesn't seem to be anybody going this direction, so we're wondering where is everyone going? We'll find out by marching deep into the bowels of Taiwan till it shits us out on some kind of road, <laughs> preferably where a bus is. <laughs> and a 7 Eleven. and Damien have already gotten to the top. Now it's my turn. I stayed back so I can get some drone stuff, but I think for this one I'll have to pack the camera away. Yep, we made it. Let's pump the camera. We've done it. We've sustained no injuries. Almost lost Patty's drone. Um, but everything else went smooth, yeah? You right? Right? Yep. Are there mosquitoes up here? What the fuck? Yeah, big ones. We're having some mountaintop nibbles here. I've got a... Uh, whatever that is. It looks disgusting. I meant to eat it for breakfast and then I didn't want it, so I brought it up here. Patty, what have you got? Some of Bakari's best sweat. Nice, the sweatiest of Bakaris. And a salmon sushi roll. What? Nice. Damien, what have you got for us? I've got the famous fucking triangle, bro. The Holy Trinity. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and I got some apple black tea. Oh, fancy. Fancy. This is Tea Mountain, so you might as well. <laughs> <laughs> Put your foot in my ass. When two bodies become one <laughs> in the passion of the moment. <laughs> but some of these parts, they're just trying to kill us. <laughs> they just slap a little rope on the side of a cliff and they're like, there you go. But it works out. I'm trying to make it all the way up to this ridge and then it goes all the way down back to the museum. Theoretically, we don't actually know, but that's the uh, that's the running theory. This is nice. We're kind of all alone now. Oh, there's one guy behind us, but this is nice. Really peaceful. You can get your head straight on one of these kind of hikes. We just came from right there, walked all the way around. And we're almost down to the bottom again. Do you want an ice cream or potato for your reward? For being a good boy. I think he's going potato. Potato, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Got ourselves a little treat. Ice cream. Yep. And it's pretty f***ing gross. <laughs> <laughs> it's not good at all. Do you want to try this? I'm good. Yeah, smart man. <laughs> it's refreshing though. If potatoes had balls, we would be sucking on them. <laughs> <laughs> Tired of walking along the same road in the heat, we conspired to hitchhike our way off the mountain. The car slipped by, only slowing to satisfy their curiosity, but little more. And as each one shrank into the horizon, we knew the options were growing ever fewer. We had to get off this damn mountain. We don't know what that is. But we also don't want to go up, and we don't want to go back. So it looks like, through the process of deduction... Well, if we go down here... I think this is the one, right? Oh yeah, that, okay, that guy's to the main road. Yep, and there we can take a bus. Yeah, okay. yeah buddy. Watch out, watch your head level for the giant spiders too. Oh right? my god. Oh the no! Size of it. I can't go this way, are you fucking crazy? Look at that thing. No, what okay. thing? Oh shit! 
We've chosen to walk down Spider Trail. And spiders are my greatest fear, if you don't know this already. But we're okay. Feeling like pending victims to a spider onslaught, we trudged on with caution. Patty was cheerfully telling us about his close encounters with giant colorful spiders when he was last in a similar situation, and I was slowly trying to swallow my own head with my rib cage like a turtle. That spider trail took easily four years off my life. There's a temple here for a reason, so you can thank God that you survived. Yes, the bus. We can see it, we can hear it, we can feel it. The guy drove us like four minutes in a cab, charged 200 NT for the three of us. We thought we were going all the way back to our hostel. But no, he brought us to just shy of the Joe Fenn sign. Right there. And the kicker is, he's still driving in the same direction. So like, we could just still be in the car. But yeah. instead, we're now walking beside the taxi. That's the taxi behind Damien. And we're just walking beside the car. Like, he could have just driven us to where we had to go. Yeah. And he wouldn't give us the money back. And the police didn't help us either. So, just cut our losses and march onward. Fuck it. Swallow your pride and just walk. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Never a dull minute in a joke, man. Let me tell you. It's it's just chaos until you get back to Taipei. It's honestly mental. Like, look at this shit. Yeah. <laughs> Patty's on his own journey. <laughs> We're in the hostel. Finally. Just a way hike. Yeah. We, uh, yeah. It's madness here. Like it's, it's complete and out of chaos. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we just hail a cab to roofing. Yeah. We jumped into a cab and fled the tourist stampede. The taxi also had air conditioning. in Taipei. We got off the train because we wanted to chill and figure out how they're going to sleep tonight. And every hostel and everything is just booked, but we're lucky. We just sat down and made a ton of calls. And we found one shady ass room at a super inflated price, but they have a home now. And we're going to part ways because I need a shower and I need food. And yeah, so we'll see you. Guys, we're all alone here in the jungle. I'm just kidding, there's loads of people. <laughs> the following day, we climbed up Elephant Mountain so the boys could get a final look at the 101 tower. We were a few of the million people that had the same idea. There is a There's a way better spot to put your, to make your. We found a good spot to park our asses and drink beer until both the sun and the tourists went away, but only one of them did. <laughs> what tower? I don't see a tower. <laughs> Eventually, we began the penguin march down the hill. As if manifested by Patty's own will, we found yet another ripe opportunity for impromptu karaoke just off to the side of the trail. Huh? Hey. 
The man was truly kind and lovely, and all too willing to let us accompany him in what can only be described as sensual harmony. Cause I'm your lady! <laughs> wow. And you <laughs> I've said it before and I'll say it again. The best part of being in the YouTube community is being open to meeting great people such as these two. A special shout out is deserved by Patty and Damien for being a part of the first video series I've made since the remaking of my channel. They turned what could have been a somber first video into a memory and a friendship I'll carry forever. Don't forget to check out the Budgeteers channel. And until next time, stay sexy my YouTubulites.